Today we are out at, um, uh, at Cobram at a tomato grower's uh, shed, more than a shed, um, and we're cleaning all the floor. Um, and a couple of cool rooms, one over there and one further over there. Uh, and also underneath all this gear and equipment. Um, it's pretty dirty, as you can see, in patches. Um, hasn't been cleaned for 10 years, apparently. So we're gonna do this. I'll shoot the video when we're finished and um, give you a look at uh, what we've achieved. I shot an earlier video with this dirty shed floor. We've done 90% of it. We're going to rinse it off. We're going to rinse all this off. As you can see, a lot of muck come off it. But we've done... This is one of the cool rooms. Uh, we picked it up with our little uh, machine. Um, the ladies looked at us and very happy. Hasn't been cleaned for 10 years. Let's give you a quick look at how black it is and how it comes up with uh, some soap and hot water. Hey, here we are. This is the shed I shot earlier. It was filthy, and now it's not. Floors, of course, it's an old floor, and it's impossible to get all the ingrain marks out. But um, the ladies looked at it; she's very happy. So there you go, two cool rooms, that one, and that one in there, and all under that machinery, been washed and dried out, and this section in here, so it's all good to go. If you've got a big shed you need cleaned, and you want your greasy floor cleaned up, call Hilo Wash, we're the experts, and we'll travel too. Particularly if you're around Cobram, that's where this is. Give us a call.